that good and it will leave you smelling yummy just yummy edible no basic zone What's good, Stitch Gang? Welcome and welcome back to another video with The Stitch Live. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing some perfumes, some fragrances that I feel like would be perfect for Valentine's Day, for Galentine's Day, for all of your Valentine's slash Galentine's Day plans. We are officially in the month of February, so I figured why not hop on here and share some fragrances that you guys could definitely look into if you guys had plans for Valentine's Day. So if you guys are interested, definitely stay tuned. Before we dive into today's video, don't forget to leave me a big thumbs up. Make sure you guys also subscribe down below if you are new to my channel. And don't forget to also follow me on Instagram at The Stitch Life. And without any further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. Really quickly, if you guys were interested in this look, don't worry, I did film a video for it. I'll go ahead and leave it linked up above. So I pulled seven fragrances out of my collection because I didn't want to make this video too, too long. And then I also have some that can be worn day or night. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get right into it. So let's start with the daytime scents. So, okay, you got a Valentine's Day brunch or you got a brunch with your boo or we're staying in a hotel and we're going shopping in the day. These two are the ones that you could wear, okay? The first one is coming from Valentino. She's a goodie. It is the Valentino Born in Roma EDP. I'll go ahead and leave notes to all the fragrances mentioned in today's video along with links to purchase them if you guys were interested in checking them out down below in the description box. But yes, this is the Valentino Born in Roma. This is such a feminine fragrance. It's such a girly fragrance and I feel like it's such a perfect fragrance for the month of February. It just screams flirty. It screams fun it screams take me out to brunch it screams take me shopping that's what this is giving me it's such a goodie if you have this one then you already know it's a fruity floral in my opinion definitely a daytime scent like if i were to put this on in the nighttime i'm definitely going to layer it with something else because i feel like it's just too fresh for me to wear in the nighttime at least for valentine's day but that's just me but if you guys own this let me know if you're putting this on this v day and if you don't own it this is the one that you need to be spraying. One of the ones that you need to be spraying for Valentine's Day or for Valentine's Day, okay? And quick FYI, I will be using the term Valentine's Day and Galentine's Day because you could definitely celebrate Valentine's Day by yourself. You could celebrate it with a boo or you could celebrate it with your friends or even with your mom. Okay, the next daytime fragrance that I feel like would be perfect, perfect for a day out is coming from Moogler. Rest in peace to Moogler, he recently passed, but it is coming from Moogler and it is Angel Nova. This is she, she is an EDP, bottle is stunning. I feel like from the bottle you could tell that it's a daytime fragrance. And I feel like from the bottle you can also tell that it'd be perfect for V-Day. And when I say that it is, I mean that it is. This is such a strong fragrance too. Like this is gonna last all day. You don't even have to worry about respraying this fragrance this lasts all day long this is also another fruity floral if you like those scents you would really really like this this is a strong one though so if you don't really like the strong scents this might not be for you but it is such a good fragrance when i finally got my hands on this i couldn't stop spraying it so if i happen to have any daytime plans during that v-day weekend i'll definitely be bringing her out on one of the days at least one of the days so i only had those two fragrances for the daytime but i have three fragrances that i feel like can be worn all day long and then i'll go ahead and hop into the nighttime scents but the first one that i feel like can be worn all day long is the c fiori by Giorgio armani now to my knowledge this was discontinued but my sis jay just told me that they actually have this on fragrance net so when I say I'll be picking up another one, I really mean it. Like this is such a good fragrance. Definitely screams feminine, screams sensual. It's just, it's everything in a bottle. Like I say often that if I could be a perfume, this would be one of them. I'd have to be like three different perfumes though, but this would definitely be like one of them. Like this is me in a bottle. Like if I could wear this all day, I would wear it all day. It smells so good. I feel like from the bottle, you could even tell that it's a nice and feminine scent. It is kind of powdery, but not like grandma powdery. I just, if you know, you know, this is a good one. If you smell this, you know, it's a good one. I'm definitely pulling her out during V-Day weekend, for sure, for sure. The next one that I'm about to show you guys is a recent pickup of mine, and it is coming from Gucci. It is actually my first Gucci fragrance. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really love Gucci's perfumes or like that. I don't know if it's just me, but they're not all that. 
in my opinion but this one is really nice this is the gucci guilty intense pore femme this is an edp so i really like the gucci guilty pore femme the original the edp the parfum um and then i went ahead and smelled this one and i just found that it was a bit stronger than the original perfume so i went ahead and picked it up but this can also be worn all day long wow wow this is giving grown and sexy though it's not for the girls that like bright crystal it's not for the girls that like light blue and no shade no tea to y'all if that's your everyday go-to fragrance this is nothing like that okay this is this is warm this is sexy this is flirty this is a different type of vibe this is going to give you a different type of vibe it smells really really good it has that floral note in there as well but it has like that warm vibe to it as well so i really like this i feel like this could be worn throughout the day because it is a warm scent but it's not super heavy if that makes sense so i feel like this would be a great fragrance to wear all day long if you wanted to the next one is probably one that you guys expected to see in this video and it is carolina herrera's good girl edp this is she this is the original carolina herrera i feel like if we're gonna talk about fragrances for dates for a date night or for a day date we have to include her we just have to include her this is femininity in a bottle in my opinion like girl look look at the bottle so if you know you know this is a goodie i don't even really have to go too much into why this is a goodie it's just a goodie it's a classic scent it's something that you can't go wrong with i feel like i've met no one that doesn't like this fragrance it's something that you cannot go wrong with so this would also be a perfect scent for you to wear throughout the day and it lingers really nicely on the skin as well it's not overpowering but if you smell it you're like "Ooh, that's nice type of vibe i also feel like a lot of the girls will be pulling this out for v-day maybe it's just me but yeah definitely stellar perfume for the valentine's day weekend now we're moving into nighttime scents and then i'm going to share two that i actually don't own that if you were looking to get an expensive fragrance or two expensive fragrances they would be perfect for the valentine's day weekend but let's first dive into these nighttime scents so the first one is one of my favorites i love her so much i'm so sad because a lot of you guys tell me that this fragrance does not last on you and it lasts for a while on you so i'm really really sad about that but it is the killian princess edp you don't need a prince to be a princess and that's on period so you could definitely wear this if you're going out for a galentine's day dinner or if you're going out for a solo dinner you could even wear this if you're going out with your bae okay the marshmallow note just stands up in this when i say stands up it stands up you will smell 100 percent edible when you put this on like edible and i find that this is a great fragrance to pair with other fragrances as well this one is definitely coming out i am definitely pulling this one out for v-day weekend you could bet your bottom dollar on it okay because it smells that good and it will leave you smelling yummy <laughs> i'm just too much the last fragrance that i physically have that i want to share with you guys is also something that i've recently picked up and this one lasts all day it smells really good and it's pretty affordable in my opinion for the size that you get and it is the billy ellish edp this is ellish tis she stunning bottle right long lasting scent sensual scent warm vanilla scent so if you like that type of vibe i do have a full review and unboxing of the billy ellish fragrance if you guys want to check that out i'll go ahead and leave it linked up above for you guys to check out this also lasts all day long you can mix this in with a few different fragrances i've been doing so as well and wow i've really been loving this fragrance i feel like the bottle should let you know the type of vibe that it's given right femininity in a bottle and in a fragrance now i'd more so put this on in the nighttime even though i've been wearing it in the daytime i've been mixing it with a few other scents to kind of like tone it down just a little bit just so it's not that warm but you could go in for the kill with this for the nighttime for sure for sure for sure and you can even mix it with a few of your other warm scents if you want to spice it up just a little bit but this is such a good nighttime fragrance in my opinion another one that if you want to smell edible if you want to smell yummy this is going to take it there this is going to take you there okay and i mentioned again that it is pretty affordable as i mentioned this is a pretty affordable fragrance as well this honestly might be the least expensive fragrance that i have on this table right here okay so definitely take notes and i want to share two more fragrances i don't physically own them but i'm going to be owning them very soon i've sprayed them on my skin i know how long they last on my skin and i really really like them and i feel like they would be perfect perfect for the valentine's day slash galentine's day weekend the first one being the killian angel share perfume the killian angel share edp 
This is also something that can be worn all day long, but I feel like for the nighttime, for the nighttime, it's gonna hit different. Yummy, it's giving yummy, it's giving you smell really, really good. It's giving what fragrance is that? It's giving who just walked past. That's the that's the vibe that you're getting from this fragrance when you wear it. And it truly does last. So I sprayed it on me when I went to Sephora and I smelled it hours later on my skin. It is truly a fine, a fine fragrance. So that's the first one. The second one is one that you guys should also be familiar with if you've been paying attention because I've been talking about it on my channel as well. And I don't have it as yet, but I'm definitely looking to purchase it very, very soon. This is the Perfumes de Marly Delina EZP. And when I say that fragrance smells the F good, I mean it smells the F good, okay? The bottle shall also tell you that it is perfect for the V-Day weekend. It is the perfect fragrance to wear if you're taking yourself out. It's the perfect fragrance to wear if you're going out with your girls. It is the perfect fragrance to wear if you're going out with your boo, okay? I feel like this is also a fragrance that can be worn all day long. You can put it on for brunch or you can put it on for dinner. It's just, it smells absolutely amazing. I have yet to smell anything that smells like this fragrance. They just really did their thing when they curated the fragrance okay it's that good so those are all of the fragrances that i would recommend for your valentine's day weekend whether you're going out for a solo date whether you're going out for a date with the girls whether you're going out for a movie date with bae or dinner with bae i recommend all of the ones in this video if you guys have any recommendations definitely drop them down below what will you be wearing during the upcoming valentine's day weekend let me know down below i'd love to hear your recommendations before we head out if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to leave your girl a big thumbs up make sure you guys subscribe to my youtube channel down below follow me on instagram at the stitch life and with that being said thank you guys so so much for watching today's video and until the next one i'll see you guys all later bye guys so i pulled out seven out of my collection because i didn't want to so i pulled out seven if if we were talking about date night if we were talking about date night or day out with the then i also have some that can be worn and then i also can be i'm going to be sharing live so in today's video i'm with this stitch live so in today's video I'm, it is the perfumes de marley it is the perfect it is the delina it's tis she stun you can wear it's a great that